welcome to our learning to cook pizza journey and this is my second cook with the uni as you can see the temperature has gone really high like 10 to 15 minutes since I last cooked in here and I put a log on five minutes ago and this pushed the temperature right up and that flame is roaring in there so I just want to show you the temperature on the stone in the middle right now is over six, 500, what does this go up to? Right, so the stone in the middle is over 550 degrees centigrade. So that's showing, yeah, it's, it's 550 in the middle. So I'm gonna leave the door off and let that cool down. Even though I'm not gonna be cooking for another 10 minutes, that's gonna take a good while to come down. been off for 10 minutes and I'm going to put the pizza door on now I'll show you the temperature it's gone down 110 degrees okay so I'm gonna I'm gonna put this in now that temperature hoping this pizza doesn't split because it's, it's a bit of chocolate up there as well oh, it's a together. Let me sit back because this is really hot. So when you use flour it doesn't seem to show a sort of, I don't know, just Disappears in the wind, but with um, semolina, it doesn't. So your goes more. I don't know if it's more messy actually. I know that's completely right because my stone is so hot. I'm pulling it right forward. You can see that. So coming out of a very hot stove Quite a few of you have asked about the temperature for the next cook. So I've just cooked that pizza, made one heck of a mess. 
and the stone temperature in the middle is 400. So I'm going to put the door on. See the door on now, we'll burn up my mess and I'll just check the back because I need to do another cook. So I just want to see, yeah. So that was just one log for my second cook and I, most of it was trying to cool the oven down. I'll put another log on for my third cook but not just yet. I'll put it on about five minutes before. What I'll do is I'll just stick some lump wood in just to keep that going. wood fired crust so do you think it's better with the flour or with the semolina please let me know what you think in the comments below I just want to say, I've just had a little bit of the crust. And normally, when I get asked the question, can I taste any difference between the gas and the wood cook? I say, oh, just a slight difference. But I have to say that I just had a mouthful of crust then and I tasted wood. <laughs> I tasted the wood. That was a wood-fired, crusty taste. So it depends on maybe how you cook it or how ashy or stone gets or how I just think that my oven was really hot and uh, you can see the difference I, I just still don't think this camera is picking up the golden color of the base very well but you can see the I think you can see it there more if I do it at that angle you can see the the white dome the golden crust it's probably a better example Give that a try. Mmm, these Frankfurter sausages with the Swiss cheese, bit of mushroom, and the mozzarella, and the bit of potato, sliced potatoes on the top, makes one really tasty pizza. Very yummy, really yummy, very nice. And don't forget to check out our website, gottoeatpizza.com. Link is below. <laughs>